prude, I think would be a bit far. I'm not very... I find it quite difficult to... I've never been one of the lads, I suppose. Um, I get quite excited about constellations and foraging. I am good at computer programming, debugging, coding and compilation. I don't much like travel uh, or too much change. I've only owned a television for three weeks and that was because the lady who used to live here, uh, Felicity something, uh, left it behind and I quite like University Challenge and I don't mind Blue Planet. But I can't do much more than that. Which is odd, I suppose, because Blue Planet is about an entire world and EastEnders, uh, for example, is about one street or square, as much as I can gather. I don't drink much. The taste isn't... I can't... Never enjoyed it. Apart from arches. And lemonade. And that isn't something you can order in a pub. With... With the aforementioned... Lads. Not that I know any lads. Actually, well, Mike, maybe, uh, who studied physics and was in my college and once um, uh, relieved himself, number two, uh, on a girl who was in asleep in her bed after too many snake bites. And if some of you need me to elaborate on that sentence, I can't, really. So, so I couldn't tell you what a snake bite actually is, other than a beverage that seems to make people incredibly drunk. I find people quite difficult, actually. I've never been the most I've always wanted to be, to be someone who could, with people, and not just stars and planets and fireworks, and it has always been beyond me, but just out of reach. It was on the 18th of July when my heart began to beat and I began to bridge that gap and, and, and be, be on the brink of being a real live human because all of a sudden I am in love. <sighs>